those really bright students who's involved with the Bronx High School of Science, one of the best high schools in the country. His meteorology program, he calls in every morning to us. Anyhow, Charles and the Bronx High School of Science will do this one for you. In and around the tri-state area, we're looking at a live shot. It's quiet. You can hear that word in the forecast. 30 humidity, 63 west A. Gusting to 16 miles per hour, and the wind chill factor is in at 20 degrees. We're going to check back on this date as we end the month. And once again, it can get real wild in around the tri-state area. In 1920, it got down to minus 1. 1947, it got to 63, 8 inches of snow in 1882. But right now, as we speak, low 30s for the city, 28 degrees in Islip, from Allentown to Trenton to Wrightstown to Belmar to New Brunswick to Newark. Everybody's looking very good and everybody's looking real quiet. And again, the night will feature fairly good looking temperatures. Tomorrow again, we'll moderate just a little bit, getting into the low to mid 40s. This is a vapor shot. And again, you'll be able to see another shot of Canadian air coming on in and will arrive here on Wednesday and then a good moderation in temperatures. Nothing to worry about up now the eastern seaboard of the United States, border to border and coast to coast. No major storms. We are safe. So the cold air will arrive one shot on Wednesday, then will moderate nicely on Thursday and Friday, and it looks really good. For the remainder of tonight, partly cloudy and breezy, the city 25 to 30, north and west 20 to 25, and for tomorrow, some sun, some clouds, maybe a snow shower again. No 